good evening. And I say evening because it's Friday and it's Friday evening. Just heading out to the weekly Bikers Inc. meet over at Claverdon. Drag the old bill out because it's dry and it's forecast to be dry. Oh, my cold tyres is horrible. <laughs> Yeah, over to Calabodon we go. So I've owned the Buell for about 10 years. Uh, also known as Feathers McGraw. Because <laughs> I think he just looks like the penguin out of Wallace and Gromit. Yeah, the one with the glove on his head and a bit sinister. So it's a 984. I'm quite out of practice riding it. It's a bit of a handful, but it's oh so good. The Buell was actually my first bike. I came off a 125 and hopped straight onto this. And I remember buying it and, uh, oh, on the drive where the person aboard it off and I remember sitting there and my eyes were vibrating and I couldn't really see where I was going until I got into the river until I got, <laughs> until I got into the rev range and I've never looked back what a really good bike it's been I've probably covered oh, 23,000 miles on it now since I've owned it it's not bad going. I did a full refurb on it two years ago. It's all the bearings, all the seals, all the everything. And it rides like a dream. I think this is the only bike I would never sell. It would take a lot for me to sell this. I don't mean money, I mean I'm so emotionally attached to this bike. We've been through a lot together. So we're just coming into Ulster. Or Ulcester. <laughs> Ulcestershire. <laughs> Oh, look at all the flags, aren't they pretty? So, Ulster. The home of lots of lovely little independent shops. Uh, this place, it holds a couple of food festivals throughout the year and lots of nice events here. Always quite like Ulster. Apart from the speed humps. <laughs> Just going to Clavadon. Uh, off the top of my head, I can't remember the name of the pub, but I think there's only one pub, so. <laughs> you know what, considering it's almost May, it's so cold. A bit fed up of it. <laughs> this should be nice warm sunshine now and barbecues and. Ay, ay, ay. Tell a lie, there's two pubs in Clavadon, and it's not that one. <laughs> I do is sorting the mounts out a little bit on the build because there aren't any, I've just got this one. There's no room for anything, it's just so compact and bijou. Anyway, I think just around this corner should be the Bikers Inc. Red Lion, of course it is. Ideal.
Samuel behaves itself. Of course he has. Of course he has. <laughs> yes. You all right? Yeah, good. Yeah. So here we are at the Red Lion at Claverdon uh, for the Bikers Inc. meet. It's on every Friday night. Always worth coming and uh, visiting. There's always some cool stuff turns up. Uh, a bit quieter tonight because the weather's a bit rubbish and it's a bit cold, but uh, on a nice sunny evening, there's plenty of stuff that turns up. So Bikers Inc. even do t-shirts and hoodies and stickers and key rings and oh, you can even get like the customised well, Triumph ones with Bikers Inc. on it as well. Blimey, you can have everything here. <laughs> Thank you for modelling that. Lovely. <laughs> Everywhere I go, this man turns up. He's trouble. He's real trouble. <laughs> Hiya. Hello. You got the whole family out tonight then? I have. <laughs> you can always shy when you get the camera. It's ever so funny. <laughs> shy. That's because I'm still wanted in that very state. <laughs> oh, that's, that's what it is. <laughs> so that was the Bikers Inc. Friday night meet. Be sure to check them out on Facebook. I'll put the link in the description. Uh, a bit quiet tonight because the weather was pretty rubbish. Uh, it's so cold. I mean, we're nearly heading into May now and it's still really cold. It's just a bit rubbish. Hopefully it's going to warm up soon. Now, I always get lost on the way home from here. So, I think it's this way. We'll see. <laughs> Hey, you're never lost on a motorbike anyway, let's race it. <laughs> this is my favourite stretch of road between uh, Stratford and Bidford on Avon. At this time of night, when it's nice and quiet, uh, and the bill is singing, the music of his people with this nice cool air. Bring on the hyperlapse. couple of bends. Ooh. Oh, but what fun this bike is. If you've owned or own or have ridden a Buell, you know the fun that can be had. So that was the Bikers Inc. Friday night meet. Be sure to check out the uh, link in the description and uh, links to their Facebook page. You get all the information from there where it was and when they hold it. It's basically every Friday. It's so cold. No 
another fabulous evening on the Bureau. If you did like tonight's, uh, what do you call it, a video? I mean, like, there hasn't been a video since the late 80s or so. <laughs> what do we call this? An upload? If you like the latest upload. Be sure, anyway, to give a nice big like and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I am getting towards uh, an exciting amount of subscribers. And when I reach that number, I shall do a short in celebration. I will even find a party pop as a let off. Anyway, keep an eye out for that. Uh, if I don't see you before, I shall see you on the next one. Take it easy. Good morning. It's Sunday morning and I'm not on the bike. Um, is anyone totally fed up of the weather? Because, oh my goodness me, I am. There's so many events have been cancelled, like Bike for Life has been cancelled. Oh, you know, just reading through Facebook this morning. Everything's just getting cancelled because the bad weather. Oh, enough's enough. Anyway, uh, quick update. Uh, I'm not going out today, like I said on uh, Friday when I was out on the bill. Um, it's just too cold and miserable. Um, yesterday I went to uh, Swindon's uh, motorcycle mega store super spring sale and uh, I managed to get uh, the AGV uh, AX9 helmet um, in carbon fibre. It was an absolute bargain. It was one not to be missed. So uh, I was kind of looking forward to going out today and trying this out, but uh, maybe I have to save it for next weekend. Um, so yeah, I'm really, uh, it's like quite a highly rated piece of kit. It's nice and light. It hardly weighs anything. Uh, nice pin lock in there, which is essential. Um, so yeah, hopefully get out next weekend and give this a go. Uh, so for now, me and, uh, Maggie, who is my 19 year old cat, I'll just, I'm going to sit and have a bit of a chill day, I think. And hopefully if the weather improves, it's got to, it's really ought to, um, I will see you on the next ride. See you soon.